क्वेश्चन नंबर 173 एट व्हिच स्टेज ऑफ एचआईवी इंफेक्शन डज वन यूजुअली शो सिम्टम्स ऑफ एड्स नाउ इन केस ऑफ एचआईवी इंफेक्शन द वायरस मल्टीप्लाइज इन द मैक्रोफेजेस एंड देन इन द हेल्पर टी लिम्फोसाइट्स नाउ दीस हेल्पर टी सेल्स हैव अ नॉर्मल काउंट ऑफ 1000 to 1200 per millimeter cube of the blood but when this count reduces to 200 per millimeter cube it is reduced to this level it is at this time that the immune system is weakened and the time period in which this reduction take place this could be in 5 to 10 years so there is a long latent period now with this view if we take up these options within 15 days of sexual contact with an infected person so this cannot be true because 15 days is too less a time for the helper t cell count to reduce so much then second one when the infected retrovirus enters the host cell so it has just entered the host cell so there won't be any symptoms as yet next one when hiv damages large number of helper t lymphocytes now this is the one which is going along with the knowledge we have and fourth one when the viral dna is produced by reverse transcriptase this again is a initial step once the viral dna is formed it will integrate with the host dna and start making viral proteins so after that slowly the cells will be getting damaged so our best answer the most appropriate answer is the third one when hiv damages large number of helper t lymphocytes and then the body would be becoming prone to number of opportunistic infections which is a characteristic feature of aids so with this now let us discuss question 174